Hi guys and welcome back to another episode of the Draft of Glory, the series where we're taking teams and we're beating people and we're making money. We have made a lot of money guys, nearly 2.4 mil and uh, obviously I'm just about to show you this guys. We've got 15,000 um, coins worth of coin boost so we're going to, uh, for the rest of the week I think, yeah, the rest of the week we will be getting around 15,000 um, 15, coins sorry, from doing uh, the game. So that's a nice little boost and obviously taking advantage of the EASFC. So if you guys do want MSP, PSN codes or cheat game codes, go and check out G2A.com, their link is down below. If you're trying to hit over 4,000 likes, that would be brilliant and guys subscribe to me if you're not subscribed subscribed already this really isn't uh, any formation i like um i'm gonna go with the four two three one central players again i think that's the same, same to yesterday as well see who we get as a um, oh 95 ronaldo we'll take ronaldo as a starter guys and obviously it's not a wing version of him so we're pretty solid there in the cam position we get mcterian yeah it's gonna have to be mcterian there the uh, man of the match next cam Hoping for like uh, none of these. We could take the BPL Island, but we'll take Island. But I don't. It definitely will not be in the starting team. And the next cam to hopefully give us a La Liga. We get Boating and we get Ganzo. Um, and no BPL actually. So it's probably going to be Ganzo. No, it's going to be Boating. I'll probably go Boating over Ganzo just because of the uh, low pace that Ganzo does have. Into the CDM position. It's still looking pretty rough, guys. We have got Michael Carrick for a strong link to McTarian. We've got Nzonzi who offers nothing yet. So I'll go with that Michael Carrick link to McTarian, which we might end up using. Next to them, we get Hendo. We get Nzonzi again. Um, which I'm going to take. I'm going to take Nzonzi this time around. Henderson doesn't link to anyone on that side. So we'll take that. Stefan and Zonzi. Left back. Luke Shaw will be absolutely brilliant. Felipe Luis, Monreal, Luna. And I actually just noticed actually there is a perfect link there if we take him. So I'm going to take Tremolina. I swap them two round. Swap them two round as well. And maybe we can get like Valencia. Um, Valencia would be a nice right back to get. Let's see. Kappa. Less low rated ones. Left, right and centre. La Liga being the best, no English, no no BPL, so we'll go with Gaspar, and uh, moving on to the centre-back position, still looks rough around the edges, we haven't had the best of picks, um, to be fair, we get Matip from Liverpool, and Shawcross, uh, I will take that scare Matip though, um, for the BPL link if we decide to do it, we, it's a little more likely guys, looking like we are going to go BPL, because, well BPL-ish, Um. Go Fonte, swap them two round. And goalkeeper. Right, so West Ham or Liverpool goalkeeper would be nice. We do get Inform Larice. Taking us to 80. So we'll go with the Inform Larice for the BPL links. And now we move on into the goalkeeper. So do we get another goalkeeper? I might take La Liga this time round. I'll take Rully, uh, just in case we end up using him. Um needing him, sorry, if we go get to go BP uh, sorry, La Liga. And the picks aren't giving us the best ones, are they? There's no BPL. There's Flano. We'll take that Lopez card. Even though we don't need him. Gary. Coleman. Coleman could, will be needed, actually. Uh, yeah, we'll go with Coleman there. Into the right back. Takes us to 92 chem. And now we're just looking to start that cam and striker position with uh, midfield players. If we can get some nice ones. And we haven't. We've literally got... A mess, an absolute mess again. Next midfielder. Please give me an attacking cam. Podolski, Kevin Morales. This is hard. This is hard. Right, striker. Are we going to get a new striker? Salah. Don't be all wingers. Literally all wingers, guys. We'll take that William card, though. That is nasty. He has done me dirty here. Done me dirty. Right, into the free picks. Still looking for a lot of replacements. Danny Alves, Lacazette, Robin, Di Maria, John Terry. Um, wouldn't make a difference if I took John Terry. Lacazette at striker wouldn't do a difference. But I might take that card anyway because no one else does much for me, do they? They do not. So we will take that Lacazette. As a super sub, even though we've got plenty of them already, we do get a left wing. Oh, we get Eden Hazard, and we get Furtra. I don't like. I'll take Eden Hazard. He can play um, here. 
even though it's not looking good so far. We need some massive changes here. Uh, Verdi, Babo, Edda, Traore, Gradel. It's like, it's just wing this is a problem with going with a formation like this, dudes. Um, Edda. There's literally no way to work him into the team at all. Let's take that. Uh, let's take him, but I don't think he's in a suit. This is this is going to be a painful one. It is. We haven't had the silver picky. We get Manny. We get Sun. Like it's giving me wingers, and it's got a, we got a formation which isn't wingers. We need central players. Now we get the silvers. Uh, let's go with Forestieri. And the final pick. There's going to be a lot of players not on full chemistry in this one, guys. We do get a central player, finally. And we get Hearn and Crespo. Nice. So if we take Crespo. Or do we take Coutinho? Coutinho might be able to do something for me. Over Hearn and Crespo. Even though Crespo's going to get himself 10 chem. I'm gonna go with it like this, dude. So I'm gonna take I'm gonna take Coutinho, dropping the legend, and the reason being is because I'm gonna go swap him over to there. Takes us to 93, and take him out. 98 chemistry, and I could actually, in fact, swap them two over, and it might knock it up to 100. No, knocks it down. Actually, I don't understand why that does knock it down. Right, it's less links, isn't it? Yeah, less links. Right, we'll take it like that. So, literally, we've got four players on not on full chemistry. It's a very, very messy team. Bringing other players in wouldn't help it either. Um, no, it wouldn't, wouldn't help anything changing it. So, we li literally may as well stick it like this, dudes. It was a shame that EA decided to throw... A shed load of wingers at me. And I didn't want wingers. But what can you do, guys? Sometimes draft works, sometimes it doesn't. So we'll take um, Gaspar out as well. And we'll rock with it like that. So that's the draft for today. A very messy one to start off the uh, Tuesday morning. We have got a Santander, which will take Ronaldo to it. It'll take us to 100. Brazilian. Loads of Brazilian. So it's going to be the La Liga Sant um yeah, we'll go at Santander, uh, Jemez. Job is done. There we go. A little bit of a mass messy draft, guys. But that's what happens when you get central formations and you get given loads of wingers. Can't help it. But we're going to crack on regardless. Hopefully try and uh, pick up four victories in a row. Let's go and see if we can do it, guys, and have a bit of fun along the way. So, guys, definitely need to make up for what happened yesterday, which was obviously um, the draft final defeat and looking to make amends starting up against this team in the first round. Up against the second in form, Martial. Um, also in form, Vardy team, the Acruz in form, Rectarian in form, uh, Eden Hazard, Gundo, Shaw in form, Luis Bailly, Bellerin and Schmeichel in net. Nice looking BPL team. Martial completely rips up my defence guys and then some horrendous antics inside the area. Leaves the ball directly into the path of Tony Cruz who puts a simple tap in to make it 1-0 within the first 10 minutes. In the 16th minute Martial breaks on through again. Puts it in. 2-0 down so fast. Absolutely unbelievable and was looking like we are staring a first round defeat. Uh, in the face, I couldn't believe it. Uh, Ronaldo though squares it up through to, uh, I think that's Eden Hazard, makes it 2-1. It gives us a bit of a chance to get back into the game. Just before half-time though, Ronaldo yet again inside the area, guys, drills the ball across into McTarian, and McTarian makes it 2-2, and that uh, sends us into the second half uh, a little bit uh, into, a little bit in our favour actually. It felt like momentum had swung, swung our way, we were getting the ball nicely, getting some decent chances, and a well-worked free kick there does put us in the lead. The final goal comes from a nice bit of skill by Ronaldo, sees the ball through to McTarian, nice low driven finesse shot, makes it 4-2, and... Um, from that game, guys, we're able to hold on and uh, take the victory. Nice uh, nice game and uh, very even game, actually, but we were more clinical in front of goal. Into the quarters, up against the five at the back team, we've informed Ramos, Reed, um, Mariano, Cancelo, I think that is. Uh, the informed Felipe Luis, the record breaker Ronaldo, Team Leo Iniesta, informed Suarez, second informed Suarez, and also Neymar and a few other players in his team. Kevin Prince, Boateng, of all people, doing some work down the wing, cuts it on the inside through to Coutinho. Coutinho through to McTarian and we make it 1-0 within 10 minutes. Very, very nice attack and uh, finished off nicely uh, by our striker. 
Oh, McTavian. I think it was Cam, wasn't it? McTavian with the ball again. Starts another attack through to Coutinho. Coutinho through to Kevin Prince Boateng. And he gets on the score sheet, guys. 2 0 within 18 minutes. We were pushing towards getting that rage quit. And that only comes, guys, from scoring goals. Ronaldo through to McTavian. McTavian dribbles past the two defenders. Nice hold off there. Brilliant finish. 3 0. And uh, pushing towards the semi final now. Uh, after getting a comfortable 3 0 lead, uh, Carrick through to uh, Eden Hazard, gets tackled, ball through, um, uh, sorry, Hazard through to Bacterian, McTarian through to Willian, Willian dribbles it nicely, low driven shot, takes the deflection off Sergio Ramos actually and goes underneath the keeper to make it 4. And then the final goal of the game, guys, comes from Ronaldo as he pings it through the middle, nice bit of dribbling around Felipe Luis, works the space, nice angle. Good finish. 5-0 in the 90th minute. And uh, the dab. He was gone before the dab, guys. Rage quit. Into the semi-final we go. Up against Fertra. The 89-rated Lukaku. 94-rated Eden Hazard. The informed De Bruyne. Schneidlin and Gardner. Uh, also Glenn Johnson, Walker... Uh, Williams, Aspilicueta, and also Forster in there. Nice BPL team, obviously, with Fertra thrown in there. 188 rated, so potentially could have some nice bench players on the team. But we didn't get to find out, guys, because the, literally the only clip comes from kickoff. Um, we put the high pressure on. Uh, you can see McTarian ball through to Coutinho, Coutinho in the middle through to Carrick, Carrick through to Tony, uh, sorry, Nzonzi, and Nzonzi through to Kevin Prince Boateng. Gets dispossessed, but another bad restart by my opponent does allow us to intercept the ball. Kevin Prince Boateng tracking back, Nzonzi through to Coutinho, nice scoop turn, works the space, works the angle, squares it through to Ronaldo, nice finish. 1 0 up within three minutes. This is literally from kickoff, guys. No chance to make substitutions for either of us because no one pressed the start button and the that was the only interest my opponent had of this game was literally conceding a goal and disappearing from the start menu. No complaints. I love easy passes into the final. Into the final we go, though. Final opponent, 4-3-2-1 formation. Furtra in the centre mid and Zonzi. Fernandez, team of the year, Messi. Man of the match, Neymar. Inform Suarez, also Ruiz. Dunno on that centre back. Uh, Cancelo, uh, Felipe Luis, team of the group stage, and Testegan in net. Ronaldo bombing through in the 20th minute, guys. Nice turn back there. Drills it across to the back post where Coutinho is able to put it in and make it 1 0. Coutinho. Very, very good player. Really enjoy his central version card. Not really a fan of his wing version. McTerry with the ball here. Squares it through. Luckily gets through to Eden Hazard. He makes it 2-0 in the 27th minute. It was all going our way. And the next goal could have been potentially the way to get a rage quit. And uh, it was, guys. McTerry through to Coutinho. Coutinho with the ball there. Squares it back to McTerry. McTerry through to Ronaldo. Ronaldo deceiving in defence. Shot. Deflection. Straight into the path of Eden Hazard. We make it 3-0. And that was the trigger point for my opponent to leave the game guys and give us our first draft final victory of the week nice rage quit simple uh, simple game so let's go and have a look at the packs we get guys and hopefully something good and there we are guys I didn't think we'll win the fa uh, the draft with this team but we have semi-final we've got an easy pass with a 1-0 this guy rage quit as well in the final and uh, put away some very very nice chances Eden Hazard and Ronaldo causing the damage so what we're going to see guys is whether the Attempt was worth it. Are we going to get any decent rewards? I think I think that that is the worst draft uh, victory um, reward. In my opinion, guys, them packs are pretty bad. Uh, like I said in previous drafts, you wouldn't go and open them. Uh, when it comes to uh, uh, the promo packs, you wouldn't open them packs anyway. We get Honda, uh, Dykes. We'll keep on to the players. We'll sell that. Might use that kit. It's quite nice on that. Yeah, I might use that kit. It's a pretty nice one. Uh, so that can be a come new away kit, and we'll try and sell that Spanish um, centre back as well. Rest will uh, discard, taking us up to a little bit of coin. So not a bad goal pack that one. Usually we have got good stuff from goal packs. We get a rare player, non-rare player now, and it is Fabian Delph. Hmm. I'm not 100%. Does he sell at the moment? 500. I don't think it's worth it. Don't think it's worth it. We'll hold on to him. Let's have a look at Morel. He's not worth it either. So we'll keep an eye out on them in future SBCs. Um, get rid of them three plus the two players as well. And that, that takes us on to the final decent pack. So we've got a premium gold player pack. Three rares. I think we got one of these for losing yesterday's video as well. Uh, we get... 
81 Yang Buya. I don't know whether he. I don't. I don't even know if the SBC is still winning. Damn, if he sold for that much, I'd be getting mid straight away. He doesn't look like he'll sell. So we'll hold on to all these players um, away in SBCs. As we always seem to do, we'll get rid of them too if we can. And the final pack of today, guys, no walkout, no special card. Just the bog standard packs for winning the draft. And we get Jonas, who potentially could be a team of the week player as you guys are watching this video. I don't know, but he could potentially become a team of the week player. Um, let's see if this sells. 700. We'll hold on to him. We'll hold on to all them guys and uh, get rid of these two players there so that's today's video over and done with i was hoping for something a little bit better but what can you do guys sometimes packs are with you sometimes they aren't majority of the time on draft they aren't uh, but we're just looking to uh, make some money and unfortunately two episodes in this week one win one final loss and we haven't actually made anything three episodes left guys let's hopefully pick up some money towards the end of the week <laughs>